Let's go back into agonizing terror where we're wetting our pants with every step we take. Oh, I remember where we're at actually. Oh, wait. Did I not? Oh, I didn't. No, I saved, but I just, I think I loaded the one where. Isaac, come in. Kendra's right. The ADS is completely shot. I'll need your help to fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get to the ship's reports. It sounds like you have better access from there. When were you going to tell us about the artifact, Hammond? This marker? I don't know anything about that. It's referenced in the captain's records. They brought it up from the planet. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? CEC didn't know anything about it. You're lying. Back off! I am not the bad guy here. Ross shake you right now. You're gonna have to trust that I don't know anything about it. We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Come on down. Okay. Uh, let me look at the controls. Uh, no, I actually want to learn how to play. Oh. All right. Uh, square. I think that's stasis. Yeah. Well, I just wasted that. I forgot, I think just pressing O is real. Health, run, aim, shoot, reload. What's. Okay, that's okay. I think I got, I think I got the gist of it. I think I got the gist. Okay, let's get on with it. Hey guys, what's going on? Dude, it's been so long since I've like done like a video where I spoke. Something's gonna come out. Yeah, it's been so long guys like I've been so busy with um, my finals at school or well, even before that before the finals I was like um, Well, actually, yeah, it is a final actually like uh, you start working on the final like in the mid midway direction. Um, I've been working with 3d modeling stuff. I've, it's been a lot of fun It's been one hell of a ride a lot of work because I've never used the program before but I had a lot of fun with it It was like really 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 cool. I got a B plus in texturing one, a B plus in my history and principles animation class, and I got a C plus in my intro to my class. Um, I kind of expected that. I didn't do as great as everyone else in the class, but I worked my butt off and I'm really proud of what, what I got to do. So I, I'm actually I'm actually really proud of that C plus that I got. I think I kinda know why I got a C plus. There was one homework assignment that I didn't do which was an animation ball, but I didn't have time for that. I was just working on my room. All right, and the, one of the reasons that I haven't been uploading that much is like, um, I'm not sure if you guys know, but this is kind of a serious issue. Um, there's been this thing called the COPA Act. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys have known about it. Um, it's a very serious act where now you have to label your stuff, your videos, as either for kids or not for kids. I think they have updated, like, be before, like, earlier on in the, like, when they first announced it, they were very vague of, like, the rules and regulations. There was mass panic amongst YouTubers to the point where they were thinking, I want to delete my channel because if you, like, mislabel your video information wrong, um, you could get fined up to $42,000. And I was like, I don't want that. So over break, I got to label my videos, like, correctly. Um, but I won't go too much into that. Um, the point is, I want to say is like, I don't plan on deleting my channel. I hope not. I hope it doesn't get to that point. You know, I'm going to try to label everything correctly based on like, you know, I got to go look through that rules and regulations video again that they posted and just be like, okay, my video is for kids, not for kids. Some yes, some no. Anyways. Yeah. I'm not going anywhere. You know, like this, this shit's not going to scare me, you know? So fuck. <laughs> okay, I know before that like, I needed to turn on the button. Just a smidge. Warning. Hull breach detected. Isaac. 
patch on the bridge, right at your feet. I'm reading heavy damage, but containment looks solid. Life support is stabilized. We've got to get the ADS working. And that's down there. Okay, I don't know what anyone is going to be expecting. Kind of really scared. Let's, let's focus on the terror. We found the hive guy, honeycomb guy, the big fat dude that spews out those little, little itty bitty creepy crawlies. What is this? A level 3 suit. I don't need it. I'm pretty good with the one I have. Alright, uh, I hope. Oh, this is. Oh, Isaac. Damn, you scared me. The place is making me jumpy. Fucking asteroids coming through the roof. Look, I know Kendra doesn't trust me, but I don't know anything about a marker or anything else. This is supposed to be a repair mission. Plain and simple. This mess is the asteroid defense system. I can fix these boards, but the main power routing is shot. You're gonna have to reroute them manually through at least three junction boxes to activate the primary cannon. Oh, but first, you need to activate the atrium elevators from bridge security. You can use them to get to the junction boxes. By the way, Isaac, be careful. I saw something out there. I don't know what. I only got a glimpse. But it was big. Really big. Yeah, I saw. I almost took a chop out of me. As I was making my way over here. Making my way on down. Flavor fuel. I don't need that. <laughs> More flavor fuel. Okay. Give me a lot of useless shit. Shit. Stand back. What? Oh, that one was dead when I sealed the pod. These things don't die easily. Okay. <laughs> I thought he was gonna lock us in and we had to fight him. I'm actually not worried. You have a pretty kick ass button. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah, I'm pretty confident with this. It's a good gun. Look around, just in case. Oh, look at that. What is this? Let's look. Well, I'm gonna have to look at that. Let's yeah, there we go. There. Whoa. Oh! Ah, I'm gonna throw us right in there, aren't Oh boy. The weapon can't punch through that thing's armor. Shoot it in the back, Isaac. And how do you have to Which 
means that we can only spend two. Remember, there's doors out there that you need to use a power button. People use it. Okay. this puppy. All right. Tanya, oh, yeah, yeah. See, we're already upgraded to damage. All that's left is reload uh, capacity. Oh, just one more for reload edge. Um, a rig, which is mostly just how much hit points we can take or how much air. I'm not worried about hit points so much, just air, but there's like so many nodes that I'd be wasting. One, two, haven't upgraded anything, and then three. So, yeah, I don't know. The thesis is just the range that you can get, which, you know, I don't really worry about range when they're coming at me really quickly. I just get whatever sneak I need. Um, this is actually oh I'm actually I didn't realize I was so close. All right, duration yes, energy yes. Okay, and then I'll pop in another one for duration and energy, and then yeah, I'm sure I'm sure I'm pop one in, and then we'll save the last power node as an emergency in case we run into a door. Atrium elevators are now online. This is mutiny. You'll all be tried for mutiny. Kind, make them listen to reason. Settle down, then. Hold him. By Maritime Law, Article 5469, I hereby declare Captain Benjamin Matthias unfit for duty. The marker must be delivered to the church. Terence, please. I'm sorry, Ben, but I can't let you do this. Traitor. Heretic. Hold his head. Murderer. Hold him. Jesus, oh my god. Oh. 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 No, it was an accident. I, I had to stop him. Arrest the doctor. How the hell were you gonna stop him with the needle to the freaking eye? I thought I thought he would see reason with just one eye. <laughs> Oops. More thing. I don't need that. And remember, guys, I'm only using one guy. Plasma energy, just just for the achievement. What the frick? I'm the only one who hears that. What is this contact beam? That's actually very useful. Very useful weapon, but I'm like I said, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna use it. All right. Wait. Save. Okay. 
Okay, I am. And you guys know I'm on break right now, so I'm gonna try to get as much video games as I can. Okay, I wanna finish Spider Man, I wanna. Oh my god. <laughs> I know a faker when I see one. Gravity plating is malfunctioning. Uh -oh. Keep an eye out for any kind of distortion effect coming from the floor. It could be dangerous. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> I, I remember I kept hitting some. Also, let this guy like, come to us. Yeah, those things. Oh god, he didn't alter it. But I didn't know. I, that thing is so narrow. How am I gonna get through that? Oh god. Baby. Ah! <laughs> 
entire room, this guy shoots shit at you. Yeah, I forgot he like he shoots crap at you. Rerouted. I'm making some progress with the tracking grid. One of the cannons is giving me a hard time. Keep moving. What does that mean at the cannons? more gravity plates, please. Those actually scare me more than the monsters themselves. You gotta be really careful when you walk by them. <sighs> I've actually been meaning to play more horror games. Like, there's one that's called Faith. It's a pixelated horror game. Um, I don't know why it is, but I think... Pixelated games scare me more than this these kind of games like Dead Space. Like, yeah, they have jump scares and they like freak me out. I'm like, oh shit! But it's not like it doesn't linger on with me like in my mind. You know? It's just like it's not something that I think about. Like, oh my god! Like usually at school, I stay there until like really late at night, like at 1 a.m. And uh, where, where? 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 Jesus. 
Jesus. Is there any more that want to come out? Huh? I've lost every one of you. me the most because like I guess the rest is left up to imagination like faith I saw some gameplay for that it's like actually pretty freaky it's not freaky but it's just like I don't know it's just left to the imagination there's that game there was this game called Uncanny Valley that I played like a while back but uh I had to delete the videos mostly because it showed my face I, I'm, I'm at this point right now I'm kind of like trying not to show my face I love being the sense of mystery, and also there's some people that I've seen at school that watch. I saw some watch my videos. I'm like, oh god, I can't let them know. I don't want them to get. Got a good amount. Done. And then another pixelated game. I don't think it's really pixelated. It's Clock Tower. That game's free. That game scares me too. I never played it. I seen gameplay, but it's just very eerie. Alright, how many? I think we have four. Well, we can only use three because we want to keep one in the chamber and make sure we use it. Alright, open okay, this. So. Okay, that's going to be hella useful. Okay, so. Let's see what else we can. I mean, yeah, this could, I guess that could be useful. And a reload is actually pretty good, I guess. Yeah, maybe reload. I don't know. Stasis is very helpful, so. Okay, so. Fit Realistically, we will be using four to fully upgrade this. Or well, three if I use one of them. And then this is another three. And this takes a fuck ton. Like I said, I'm mostly concerned about air. Because I don't want to spend too much time out of the world. But I don't remember any other air sequences that we have to use. Plasma cutter, we're already up here that. This, is all, this will upgrade your range by four. But like I said, I'm not I don't really go long range. I just go up close with whatever's like around me. So. Duration or energy. I'll go with duration, so we'll put one right there. Alright, and then we'll save one. Alright. Let's go down under. Let's kill some more baddies. reports. These things are biorecombinators. They take dead tissue, absorb it, and mold it into new forms. One iteration seems to have the sole purpose of infecting corpses. The others, well, seem to be making corpses to infect. And that body tissue we keep seeing on the walls is part of it too. I found a report that says it's a habitat changer. Oh, I think I know what they're talking about. Uh... Now these creatures, they don't kill you. Well, they do if you stand close to them. But they don't come out and attack you. They just like, they're just right there. They're like, think of them as a humidifier. 
but they spew crap at them. But yeah, they're, they're like, they're like really freaky. They make this weird Darth Vader, but more fleshy noise. It's really disgusting, but uh, it's gross. Everything in this game is gross. What am I saying? That's putting it a little too lightly. Alright. Are you... Are any of you guys changing? Okay. Well, this is gonna suck because we won't be able to hear them coming. Oh, I think this is where he pops out from. Here. a bench but we don't use it. We don't need it. We have one which we don't want to use. There's gonna be a moment. Or maybe not. Oh boy. Okay, why am I in? He can't come out of there, it's on fire. the one with the power note. Everything, I know. Don't come out of there. Don't come out of there. Alright. Right. Right. We're doing good. We're doing seven goals. Oh god, what? Where? Where did you come from? Out there, don't mess with me, man. Yeah, I know you're out there. I know it's out there. Now. I don't want to just, I'm not afraid of it. I just don't want to be like, oh no, it just 
step on these by accident. Alright, I'll just stay some. I see you, you little sneak. Box rerouted. I'm getting a reading. Almost there. Oh, wait a minute. What the? That wasn't. Ah, what... oh, man. Just be careful. Hug the wall. Hug the wall. Hug the wall. You good? Okay, we're good. And they made it more difficult to get up there at all. There's gonna be something on the other side. I just know it! Entering yeah, this is where it gets really quiet and they decide to spring a surprise on you. Or maybe not. Maybe they're gonna be nice. I used it on the, the door. Oh, oh me, oh my. You're gonna have to fight another big one. Make us whole again. What the frick? Hi, buddy, what's up? Whoa. You look a little pale there. Uh. This is Temple. The bridge is fucked. I don't know what went on in there, but I'm not sticking around in case whatever did it comes back. I'm heading for hydroponics to find Elizabeth. Oh, the force gun is a very helpful tool. That is like a great crowd controller. Um, you don't. That gun doesn't really rely on. You know how, like, with the plasma gun, you have to, like, really actually have to aim, you know, you have to actually. Hit certain points. The force gun, you don't. You just choose in a direction, like let's say right here. Doesn't matter if I'm shooting this way, this way, or that way. It's gonna get everything. It'll push them back. It's not gonna kill them. It's just gonna push them back, giving you enough time, like you know, to save yourself. Uh, and if you upgrade it more, it actually does damage. So that's it's a very helpful gun. I will definitely use it on my second play. Whoa! You. Oh, dumb. Okay, I wasted that because I was really nervous. But I did all for the sake of just not hitting his belt. So remember, if 
you hit his belly instead of his wings, he hatches all this shit. It's really hard to kill it when you just have the plasma crystal. There's actually a trophy for this, actually. Let me save. Let me save, just in case. the one where he's on the other side. I remember it. Watch. Or not. Never mind. I could have sworn. Yeah, it, it did seem like it was that way, but maybe he'll be right. Maybe. I just hate, like, when you... Oh, wait, wait, wait. What if he's on the other side when I come out? Yeah, I vaguely remembered. He does. It is in the first game where that happens. And it's definitely in the second game. I do remember a certain part where he does it. Like that. Yeah, in the first game, he will. There will be an, an enemy on the other side. And it seems like you know, it's right there, it's just gonna like spring trap him. What is this? Isaac, you're going to have to cross the ship exterior to reach the ADS cannon. Problem is, we're still getting bombarded by asteroids. Look for cover, or you'll get torn to pieces. Okay. I remember this. I actually died because I didn't know what was happening. <laughs> Maybe I'll die just, just to show you. This. I, I remember just going in, like, you know, like, Oh, I just gotta run from this end to the end. There's, there's no problem. Da -da 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 -da. Watch. Entering vacuum. I remember I was just like, oh, Entering I just gotta zero run. Gravity. I just gotta run? Oh, that's no problem. Warning. Multiple da -da 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 -da. impacts detected across the starboard hull. I didn't know that. <laughs> Actually, I didn't even see anything that was like coming my way, so I didn't know. Ugh. Okay, let's try it again. This time for real, let's not go away. Entering vacuum. Entering zero gravity. Warning. Multiple impacts detected across the starboard hull. Okay, I stop moving. Can't 
can't tell which one's the small one and which one's the big one. Okay. Run! Oh shit, that almost hit me. Can I make it over there? Can I? Ah, oh, I'm not gonna play it safe. I could have told him. Oh, God damn it. Alright, we're gonna have to. Just for safety measures. Okay, we can make it, we can make it, we can make it. Oh, God. Ah, oh, you could have told me that. Run! Run to the very end! Oh god, don't you dare kill me! Run! run. Exiting zero gravity. Okay, I. Yeah, there is a safe point here. Exiting vacuum. What is this? There are ripple blades. Okay, so we can save here. Good! A ruby. Ooh, those are worth a lot. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 yes! I want to pick this up. Okay, that is a lot. Okay. Okay, so this one you have to not get hit that much. Doesn't have to be perfect, but you have to like destroy a good amount without sustaining a certain amount of damage. I want to get that. So I may have to cut it out if I end up fucking up. You're in the pit. The cannon's a mass driver, so it should punch through anything flying at us. Keep an eye on the hull's integrity. Too many of those things get by, and we're dead. I think I've almost got the system repaired. Just buy me a little more time. flying at us. Keep an eye on the hull's integrity. Too many of those things get by, and we're dead. I think I've almost got the system repaired. Just buy me a little more time.
have to save orbit. As soon as we're clear, I'll engage the autopilot again. Head to the tram station, and I'll meet you there when I'm done. Are we done? Oh, oh, God. Oh my god, that was not easy. That took me like me uh, five tries at least. I thought it would take me more, but yeah, that that whole <laughs> aiming is a little finicky. But yeah, you have to keep it um, above fifty percent. If you go below fifty percent, then you must have been cheap. Good thing there's a safe place right there. That was really generous. Entering vacuum. I think Entering zero gravity. Mary Sue and Gregor, we can just run along. Oh. How's it going? Yeah, we may want to move really quickly. I see you. I don't have an air can, so I'm gonna have to brush through you guys really quickly. I'm sorry. I can't really stay the play. One last scare, right here, right behind there, right? No. Right. Exiting zero gravity. Uchi mama. All right. Do we get Exiting vacuum. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's wait for you on the other side. I right? want. Whoa. Isaac Hammond, you're not going to believe this. Oxygen levels are falling. Something's poisoning hydroponics air production, and whatever it is, it's filling the deck up with that organic stuff. We're not going to have any air to breathe soon. But if I understand these lab reports correctly, I think I can make a poison to destroy it. Head to medical. It should have everything you need. Will this never end? Isaac. Get to medical and mix together whatever Kendra's come up with. I'm heading to hydroponics. If I can slow it down, that might keep us breathing long enough to fight it. Okay, cool. Hey, I feel like I didn't think come down to the elevator at some point. I think I remember that. Okay, oh god. This is the point where someone comes at me, right? Right? Those things are freaking creepy as hell, guys. Oh, oh. 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 oh! God, those things are freaky. There's gonna be another one around this thing. Yeah, those things are like. <laughs> they're not the most lethal, but you know, they're just like any other enemy, but. Like, oh, bitch. Oh, God. Where do I want to go? I'll go to level two to see, just to be sure. But yeah, um, you know, they come in those parts where they're separate, but also they could form like a human like, you know, they form together to build like a humanoid version. And that, that is freaky. I'm like, oh, God. And it starts with the humanoid version, like, once you, like, kill it. Um, it will... What's going on? Yeah. What is that? That sounds like a creature, not... Not the astral. Do I have any power I have zero. There's my own. Gun. 
Okay, large, we're selling this. Yes, we're selling this. Yes. Oh, yeah, we got the semiconductors. Yes. Stasis. Just to get it out of the way. Save progress, yes! Let me check how long this is. About an hour and ten minutes. Okay, that's about the usual time it's been taking to complete these chapters. Except for the first one, that took pretty quick. Okay. What are we doing? Um, lethal Devotion. Oh, that's where we run into those creepy suction whatever they call it. That's the one. Okay. I'll stop when we get to the store. <laughs> Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off the ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. Oh wait, you can't is... stand in the way of God's plan. The natural order. Are you are you blind like the rest? What? What if I do that one creepy ass? Looks like there? someone has reprogrammed the door locks on this deck. And recently too. I guess we're not alone here after all. Someone doesn't want you in this part of the ship. I don't know if you guys remember, but there was like, we saw that one creepy ass guy that was like half dead and then half alive, and then he just saw us and then he took off. 
I wonder if we would encounter them in that chapter or are we gonna encounter them here? That would be really cool. That's something that I that I really liked about this game. I'm starting to remember that the second one lacked is like those special kind of bosses. I mean, you didn't really get to fight like actual people or like like it was just like pure necromorphs in the second one. And this one you fight like a mixture, you know, like people that are like they're like well the thing is they're they're necromorphs. You, you, they turn into necromorphs that you have to fight. But it's just kind of really cool when you see them like turning into them or something like that. Or just, I don't know. I don't know. There's just a lot of backstory when it's like one specific necromorph, though. It's kind of a good example is like Borderlands. You know, there's like, like the one that I can remember is like the Halloween one where there's this one guy who leaves audio logs, you know, and he has like this weird hat and he's working on the mill and he eventually gets turned into a werescag. That was actually pretty cool. The backstory leading up to that. So that's. That's what I like about this game that the second one didn't like. Anyways, that's it, guys. That's all I got for today. I'm tired. My eyes are burning because I haven't dusted my room in a long time. Um, but, yeah, man, I'm going to start getting some videos out of the way, like, to you guys as much as I can. I have a lot of catching up to do. And, yeah. So, anyways, guys, that's all I got to say. You know, thank you for watching. Leave a like, comment if you're new, and subscribe. I got that all mixed up. Anyways, bye guys. Good to see you. Good to talk to you guys again, whoever's listening. Bye bye.